Welcome to Veinlight, the world's best-selling vein access device. When you open your Veinlight kit, you will first see a detailed user's manual. Please review the manual carefully for proper operation and maintenance information before using your Veinlight. In addition to your Veinlight device, your kit may contain several accessories, such as a charger, pediatric and light shield attachments, and a starter pack of disposable plastic covers. The Veinlight is a handheld, battery-powered vein finding and accessing device that utilizes a patented transillumination technique called side transillumination. Veinlight devices offer a simple one or two button operation. Two button devices have a red and an orange button. When you press the orange button, orange LEDs will turn on that are optimized for illuminating lighter pigmented skin and superficial veins. To turn off, simply press the orange button again. When the red button is pressed, red LEDs will light up, which are optimized for darker pigmented skin and deeper veins. Press the red button again to turn off. You can also activate both the orange and red LEDs if a higher contrast is needed for vein illumination. If only one button is available on your device, it will activate the orange and red LEDs at the same time. While this simplified setting is designed to work with all skin pigmentation types, it will not provide the same contrast options of a two-button device. The Veinlight EMS Pro adds a unique feature to our single-button line of products. As with other devices, pressing the button a single time will activate the red and orange LEDs. However, pressing the button a second time will activate a white exam light for surface illumination and use in initial patient assessment. Pressing the button a third time will turn off the LEDs. Before using your vein light, a disposable plastic cover must be applied to prevent contamination from body fluids or cross-contamination between patients. To apply the cover, simply pull the cover with the fold-over flap oriented on the underside of the device, snugly onto the device and pull the fold-over flap up and over the battery compartment. Your vein light should now be fully covered and ready for use. Covers can be reordered at veinlight.com. As you scan for veins, the device should be in direct contact with the skin with slight pressure applied. Watch for any dark shadows that appear to cross the viewing area. These shadows are veins, and the darker the vein, the closer to the surface it is. This relative darkness can help determine the angle in which the catheter should be placed to properly access the vein and reduce the chance of it going through the vein. Once you find a vein that is accessible, scan up and down the vein to map it and identify a good, straight access point. Your vein light device and access site must be prepped in the same manner as any other IV access procedure. Rotate the device with the opening facing you. Place your thumb on top of the vein light, wrapping your four fingers around the limb. Gently squeeze the vein light into place. This action helps isolate the vein and provides optimal pressure for access. After closing the vein, slightly push back on the device. This will stretch the skin, raise the vein, give it traction, and prevent it from rolling. You are now ready to access your fully secured vein. Once your procedure is complete, remove the disposable plastic cover and discard it in the appropriate receptacle. The pediatric attachment is used to narrow and focus the transillumination light onto a smaller area more appropriate to infants and babies and elderly small bone patients. To use the pediatric attachment, align the opening of the adapter with the opening of the device on the side where the LEDs illuminate. Place the wider side of the adapter over the clear window. Press down and you will feel it snap into place. Your vein light comes with a light shield. To apply this attachment, place on the opposite side of the LEDs in the vein imaging area. This attachment swivels 360 degrees, allowing optimal viewing when scanning for the vein. 
The light shield is used if the ambient or overhead light is too bright, cannot be dimmed, or when used in direct sunlight. The light shield attachment will significantly minimize overhead light, providing much higher contrast and visualization to the vein imaging area. The vein light family of products are powered by either rechargeable lithium ion batteries or replaceable AA or CR2 batteries. Certain devices are equipped with a low battery level indicator light, which will illuminate when the battery charge level has dropped to approximately 20% of the full battery charge. If your device uses the rechargeable lithium ion battery, use the supply charger to return the battery to full strength. A red LED can be seen in all models through the clear window when charging, and a green LED can be seen when the battery is fully charged. The lithium ion battery that comes with your vein light has an average life of 500 charging cycles, or about three years of typical use. Replacing the lithium ion, AA, or CO2 batteries in your vein light device is fast and easy. Simply slide the cover off and lift out the battery. Some rechargeable batteries will have a wire connector that must be removed too. Replace the old battery with a new one and slide the battery cover back on. You can order replacement batteries for your device at veinlight.com. Veinlight, clinically proven to improve accuracy. For further detailed information including models, product specifications, FAQs, and a copy of our clinically proven randomized study, please visit us at veinlight.com.